two, and we're going to change the hydraulic fittings in the front. Now, we have a past video that we put the, hy the dual hydraulics in this machine, but these hydraulic fittings do not go to this plow that I had. So they were a little rusty, so I decided, you know, I'm just gonna change them out. I'll show you how easy it's done. Now, I dismantled the machine. I took the side pieces off, the front grill housing and everything. I've already pulled them back out, and I'm going to replace them with these brand new Pioneer ends. Now, the part number of these Pioneer ends are 4050-2P. 4050-2P. And what I'll do is replace them, and I'll put this 7 8 E-clip right there to hold them in. So let's get started. I already have these ones here loose. We'll take them both off. We're gonna put a little bit more elastic tape on them. Now we'll do the bottom one first. And you'll see why you have to do the bottom one first. Because you won't have room to do it any other way, to be honest. 9 sixteenths, 7 eighths. in there. Put the next one in. E-clip on. That one's not on there as good as I'd like to see it. But let's see if we can get it in there. There it goes. Okay. So now we have that on. Let's see if it works. I have my snow blade. Snow blade. Take your time putting in the blade. It takes a little bit of time. And there it is. Let's hook up the cup hydraulic couplings. And let's
let's try it, see if it works. We better hook up the control rod also, though.